So what we have here is an awesome new um, complete Flipper Zero development board. As you can see, this pin layout um, corresponds um, properly with the Flipper Zero. I do not have a Flipper Zero, but as an electrical engineer, I thought I would make you guys uh, something cool. So here I'm testing, um, not like everyone else with their Flipper Zeros, one CC10. No, we got two. So uh, let's check it out on some new custom firmware I made. Shout out to Brazil. Obrigado. Damn. Loads it up. So with this new firmware, I added in all the important functions from the original terminal version. Um, so you don't need to have a, a serial terminal. Um, you don't need to be using your computer or your phone. We got hooked up to the HackRF, like a real hacker. I don't need a case, okay? And now we're using um, SDR++ on the MacBook. All right, so this is very basic implementation. We're not using uh, the amplifier. So let's test out the first radio. As we can see, we got some power. Now let's test the second radio. There we go. Now let's test uh, both radios. So you can see that it needs a bandpass filter for sure to really utilize. But that's uh, the basic spiel. You can plug it into your Flipper Zero. Plug it into your Flipper Zero and the idea of this is to be able to quickly plug in and plug out different modules, GPS, radios, whatever, an extra screen and uh, develop your code a lot easier because you just um, have one platform to work with.